up guys? I'm uh, headed out on a run currently. I'm gonna park at my neighbor's house and run up to that point, that spot where we camp out up there. And uh, it's gonna be exciting. I haven't been up there in, since like the beginning of last summer. So I'm excited to see what it's like up there. All right guys, I parked my car here. Up there's where we're running to, the top of that mountain. And I'm gonna go out that way and loop around there's a uh, there's a path out there so parked a little bit farther away from my neighbor's house so i can get an extra mile in because it's, i think it's gonna be around five or six miles but uh we'll see how it goes <laughs> up the mountain here you can see the other mountain i usually run up over there right about this <sighs> pretty pretty steep all the way up like this and uh a lot of snow drifts so some spots are like six inches deep other spots are like a foot and a half corner just up there probably 250 yards um back there a little ways there was uh coyote tracks but they went up that way towards those was like a rock formation up there and then this rock but uh, I saw a little deer track activity at the bottom, but I don't think there'd be many up top here. <sighs> so, uh, yeah, it's pretty beautiful, right? There's a trail, the one I run up from my house, it goes down there, comes up right across from me here is where there's those rocks, Sam and I put our initials in, and then keep going up, it takes you to the top. And that is about 11 to 1200 foot elevation gain, right around there. So I'm thinking this one might be close to the same or a little higher, depending. Cause I, I didn't start from my house for this one, so it might be less, but uh, yeah. Check in when it turns up that way. Other than that, keep Alright, so we're here to the corner now. Right here it's gonna start turning up that way. But uh down down that way is where I live and run up this road down here all the time. Feels feels nice to run up here. Especially today. It's pretty warm out. My hands aren't cold and thanks to these gators feet and stuff aren't getting cold. So hopefully now that I have these gators, I can do more uh, trail running, especially since, I mean, I think at the end of this week, we're supposed to get at least like eight inches more of snow. So that's going to suck on top of this. But uh, yeah, I'll check in when I'm close to the top if I see anything, but uh, freaking glad to be out here running today in the warmer weather. <laughs> about the first time I came up here was with my friend Christian and uh, my girlfriend Samantha. Instead of going up this trail all the way, the first time it was snowy just like it is now. And we just climbed right up over there. I don't know if you can see up there, but it's like all rock walls and stuff. So that was really fun. And I think Christian's the one that showed us the spot. And uh, the first time he went up there, he actually slipped and fell like 10 feet almost died but uh that's a little good memory of up here not christian almost dying but us climbing up over the side there what's up guys i'm up here on the top of the mountain 
now. You can see that I think the uh, DCNR or someone did a, uh, probably a clear cut or something, but there's several hundred stems per acre. And they're all real little, a lot of uh, sweet cherry and um, there's black birch. But uh, I thought this was cool. I saw this from a little distance away, poking out. It was a uh, gray paper birch, whatever you want to call it. It's a, uh, I'm pretty sure its Latin name is uh, Betula papyrifera. And uh, yeah, that was cool to see that. I mean, I'm sure there's more up here, but that was the first time I saw up here, right near where we camp at. So I'm headed down that way to go to Maga Rock, which is the name of the spot we camp at. All right, guys, here we are up at uh, Maga Rock. It's a beautiful view. Go down. Let's go show you the actual spot where we have our campfire and stuff usually. Right down this yonder way. Right here's usually where we have our campfire. And then we set up our tent up in here. I mean it's usually slanted and usually sucks to sleep, but everything else, like when it's summertime, the sunset. Or, isn't he? Yeah, the sun, sunset, super beautiful over there. You can watch it. And just waking up and hearing all the birds and everything and seeing everyone down there and the creek flowing. Super cool. And in the autumn with all the different colors. It's pretty damn wide open. But, uh, yeah. I'm gonna sit up here and enjoy it since I walked all the way up here and ran but uh thanks for watching guys if I see anything else interesting on the way down the mountain I guess I'll video it <laughs> guys I made it down I only got another quarter mile to my car up there is where I came from thanks for tuning in guys God bless you all like I already said keep after your goals I love you all have a great day